on the couch. Hello again, it's the Killers, and today we're doing Mr. Men, Little Miss Mad Libs. So let's see how this goes. I'm sitting next to you on the couch, Peter. Oh, Don't boy. get too excited. Oh, oh, oh gosh, you webbed on me, Peter. Oops. Oh gosh, darn it, Peter. I'm still webbing, see? Ah. Uh. Okay. I need an adjective. Sticky. I need a noun. Alien. A noun again. Toad. Silly, silly word. Cursed blush. What? Cursed blush. Cursed blush? Yeah. Okay. I thought you said cursed bush. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's a cursed blush. Okay. Cursed blush. Okay, part of the body. Oh, they're killing each other up there. Um. <laughs> oh no! Eyes. <laughs> I mean, wait, part of body or part of body? Either one. Focus the eyes. Coral down. <coughs> sunglasses. They tripped and fell and broke your sunglasses. Occupation. Waiter. Now. Female. Now. Notebook. Now. Mushroom. Part of the body. Throat. Person in room male. Uh, Zazu. Now. Lion. And portal now. <coughs> uh, elephants. Okay. Mr. Silly's dog. Mr. Silly lives in nonsense land, and everything he does is completely sticky. He lives in a silly alien and drives a toad with square wheels. It's quite a sight to see, but almost sillier than Mr. Silly is his dog, Kersploos Kersploos. Wears a top hat on his eyes and sunglasses on his paws. He has a job as a waiter, and he drives his very own convertible suit to work every day. On the weekends, Mr. Silly's dog likes to play golf with his friend's Carissa, a notebook, who always wears a mushroom on her throat. And Zazu, a lion, who's always eat, who has always eaten elephants. No, sir, you've never seen anything sillier. Okay, next. <laughs> Okay, turtle now. Mice. Now, cat teeth. What? It's, it's not turtle now. Cat tooth. <laughs> now, trumpet. Adjective. Um. Stingy. <laughs> now, balloon. Now, um, purple kangaroo. They're all now. Street lights. 
Bourbon number 10. Bourbon 90. Running. Number negative 54. Why always negative numbers? I gave you 10 before. Oh, adjective. <laughs> Soggy. You no, know, it's hard to make the number ones funny anyways. Um, ghastly. Noun. It's more about the placement of the word than the word itself. Pokemon Center. Okay. Partying with Little Miss Fun. Little Miss Fun's favorite thing to do is throw parties. She loves to get her mice together to celebrate special events, but sometimes she just makes up a cat tooth to get everyone together. Last week she organized a game party. First everyone played Pin to Town to Crumpet. Little Miss Stingy one, of course. Then Little Miss Quick won a game of Duck Duck Balloon. Next, Mr. Tickle helped his team when he captured a purple kangaroo. The day's biggest surprise was in a random musical street light when Mr. Lazy was left with the final chair. Little Miss Curious tried to start a game of 10 questions, but Little Miss Chatterbox wouldn't stop running long enough to let anyone ask anything. Mr. Tall's favorite at the day was a negative 54 legged brace, which he and his partner, Mr. Soggy, won by a mile. Little Miss Fun deemed the party a ghastly success. She even won her own favorite game, Dodge Pokemon Center. Ah. <laughs> Oops, I lost the page. <laughs> Okay, we're ending at ING. Hunting. We're ending at ING. Tripping. Number? Six million. Verb ending in ING. Um, falling. Adjective. Gloomy. Uh, Kevin. <laughs> Part of the body plural. Veins. Silly word. Loudly. 
Whether he is hunting or tripping, you can hear him from six million miles away. <laughs> wow, that's loud. And his favorite thing to do is sing. He loves classic, classic sing-alongs like I've been falling on the railroad. If you're gloomy and you know it, and she'll be coming around at uh, Kevin. <laughs> when he gets together with Little Miss Somersault, they like to sing songs with movements like heads, shoulders, knees, and veins. And the itsy oo spider. <laughs> but Mr. Noisy really has the most fun when he and his bosses have karaoke parties. Born in the Bathroom is always his first choice song, followed by a duet with Little Miss Gross to You're the Sunglasses That I Want. He loves singing along when his friends choose, choose Pac-Man to build out, too, but he has to be careful. He's so curly that he can easily drown them out. Oh, gosh. Okay, so that was uh, Mr. Min, Little Miss Mad Libs. If you like Mad Libs and like this video, please give us a thumbs up. And if you have not already for more Mad Libs, please subscribe to our channel. And we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.